<clears throat> Today we're removing the uh, CD player from a 2004 Volvo S40. Um, we're going to start with the pry tools and actually uh, Torx. We're going to set the parking brake and uh, move down to this panel behind the uh, gear shifter and pull this back up. This is going to give us uh, access to a couple of Torx T25 screws here on the left, one on the left. And uh, one a little bit lower down here on the right. back to the pry bar and uh, with the panel around the dash we're going to start towards the upper right top and work our way up and around. This panel will unclip from the dash. And there we go, we got it started. And we lift that panel back up and out of the way. There are uh, two clips at the top on the here and uh, a couple of grooves at the bottom that go down in. So the top has to come away and, and uh, to allow it to hinge out. Next we're, we're down to the display module here. And the display module is also uh, clipped into the dash with a couple of clips and a little bit of pry pressure. We'll remove this dash and we can pull this up out of the dash as well. Now we have several connectors at the back here. Uh, I'm going to push the triggers down on them and release them. Now these are, one is fiber optics. The uh, fiber optic connector has a little trigger here on the side that you would push into the uh, connector to release. The opposite connector, the white one here, has a trigger on the top and the back and you would push that down. These uh, connectors are keyed so they go back to only one spot. And there was two clips uh, holding the display in here and here from the uh, back of the uh, control module. Now this is going to allow us to remove two more T25 torque screws from the opening with the display removed. One on the left and one on the right. Now with the key in the ignition we're going to shift to a lower gear. This is going to allow us to work on the whole entire trim panel that comes across the dash and pull that back. Uh, we have one connector in the back of it here with a trigger on it that we're going to release. Again, this connector will only go one spot and it does have a trigger on the top here that needs to be pushed down and that will release the connector. Now this gives access to the CD player which we were eventually going to get to of course. We have one Torx 25 below the uh, CD player on the right. One Torx on the bottom left as well. And we're going to pull that from the dash. And we have one main connector with a trigger on the side of it. Releases and goes right in as well. Uh, this is how you remove the CD player from a Volvo S40. Hope this video has been helpful. See our other videos for removal instructions and our do-it-yourself repairs. Thank you for watching.